What's up, YouTube? Cover on 220 and welcome back to Ireland's campaign. I got better on that accent. Hope I didn't offend anybody there. Anyway, we're gonna continue to kind of let the English kind of hold these two, these two cities. I am not too uh, bummed about that. I do quite enjoy holding my castle and getting the Irish majority though, which is good. We have plenty of money, so we could actually do. An armor, not bad, not bad. Yeah, let's do an armor. That'll help out. How about here? We're we building something at Chester. Good, we are. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna just gonna. Yes, my king. The great thing about these forces, the AI doesn't realize that they can like sally out, and they don't. So it's a great way to overwhelm the, uh, the English forces there. Move out, I lord. I'll just swap these forces and move these boys down here. So we're gonna wait. It's interesting to see how uh, what I'm wondering. You know, Wales is really not doing a good job. They lost. It's just part of Wales. People are probably going to rebel literally when I leave. Which is bad, but we have population boom, health, um, we are can run these people over, so I guess it will take a little while. Let's see if we can assassinate this guy. Leaving the army. Aye. Who needs a second smile? Name the target. Okay, there's the general walking around in non general clothes. Ooh, he did it. Goodbye, comrade. He's gone. Agent skills increase. Beautiful. More troops. Chester and Lancaster. Traits increase. Trim. He's not happy. Yeah, might as well upgrade him. I will uh leave some peasants out garrison that. And that's why they're unhappy. Why are you unhappy, Dublin? Ah, yes, you're still building the walls. 100% Irish, though, which is great. Um, grab one where you're there. Ah! These are like our spear troops. Interesting. Interesting. Losing some money. The barons are actually attacking the English in their fort there. Yeah, so... Uh, I'll make it straight. So the devastation is from said rebels, who are right around there. Something to investigate. Okay, we know Nottingham is strong. Well, I want to see uh, English forces over here. Who do you want dead, my Have our spy go around here. Who needs a second smile? Is it a person or a place then? I, my king. Can you steal I'm him? ready to approach them, father. Oh, I he's kind on the eyes. Don't fret. He'll take care of me. Traitor! I am neither your concern nor you your just concern. stole. We come in Who do you want dead? My lord. <sighs> Who or what needs rem Are we at war? I thought we were at war with England. I feel a nasty That was a good agent too. Sire. Darn. Okay, we're gonna keep turning out these agents here. And this army is gonna go after the rebels that were right here. I just don't want them uh, causing trouble. They were doing some devastation. Let's go down. Turns out we have an English fort. This is in our territory. <laughs> A Dean and the Snob. No charm. Secret lover. <laughs> Happily, sire. I love that. The it's Snob. Can you imagine if your nickname was that? Okay, these guys are just gonna hold this fort as, uh... This army is going to move on. And we're gonna capture this. Okay, so his army's here. I do want to train some basic like militia type units that will be free for this city. 
large English forces there. These guys did have a riot. Maybe I'm going to attack that. Good, no one was harmed. No taxpayers. Good, we got him. Yep. Taking out the English, that's how we do it. So, Jester built a town hall. These guys are... It's a lot of this uh, unrest, and the garrison's really helping out a lot. These kind of free units should help. I, who needs a second smile? I think this guy does. Well, yeah, I know, we kind of missed that, but whatever. Nottingham, you shall fall. Yeoman archers, though. Swords, are, that would be a great province to capture. Oh, I don't like there's other guys walking by him. This is a guy who, who stole our princess. Yeah, Brian. Thanks for taking O'Brien. Command and they're dead, sire. Good job. Okay, we're definitely pissing off the English. These guys are surrounded by someone. Yeah, I think Montgomery and Shrewsbury are gonna be our next cities we're gonna wanna gonna wanna grab here, but it's just hard because these guys will need to get that. This second army needs to come down. He's like, I don't need to take over this English fort. Just get rid of them. They have cannons already. That's not good. So we're trading some more forts here. We're going to end another turn. I know we're advanced. These guys can upgrade. Cool. Irrigation. Cannon maker. Interesting. There you go. Let's double check everybody's building something. An enemy to crush. I have too many of these guys over here. How young are these guys? Fifty-nine, twenty. Nineteen and forty-six. Okay, we'll keep the young guys. We'll go onto our boats here and we'll send them over. Now, if this army were to leave, good. Let's go meet the English and pitch. Oh, look at those sneaky son of a gun! So I'm just gonna keep assassinating uh, their captains. Some will be better at taking out some of their generals. The English have a ton of people. But yeah, if I can kind of split this. I wonder if Wales... Okay, well, Wales likes me, and they have a mixed reputation, so... I'll just build some ladders. I just want to starve those guys out. Okay, I would love to attack these guys on the bridge. Captain Joan. Wow, look at that. Ton of artillery. Well, this should be interesting. At least we're getting a battle in this part. Yeah, these. once we get rid of this army here, I'm pretty sure these two cities will fall. The question is, i got to maintain my... i got to divide my army. So the army that's besieging that fort up there, that army will move down and kind of capture Shrewsbury. These guys will go to Montgomery. Oh, this is going to be really bad. Are they coming towards me? There's no way they're... <gasps> Charge my brave soldiers. Is there a crossing on this side somewhere? 
Pull our general back. Yeah, they're trying to kill my general. There's not a crossing anywhere, is there? Nope. Let's go to this side. Okay, these guys kind of want to swim. I don't know what happened to that guy. So, this is kind of good and bad. It's good that we're, we're going to hopefully push through all these guys. It's bad that they're going to bottleneck us. And the fact they have so much artillery. I, uh, someone was asking on one of the earlier videos why I don't use flaming shot. Um, it reloads slower and has less accuracy. It can't hurt morale though. Have these guys taken any casualties? Oh my gosh. They're just... My men are routing. I'm gonna fall back. How insane is that that they have our... Oh boy, I just gotta. This defeat is a bitter drop to swallow. Oh, I can save some of my men. Wow. Oh, we'll make them regret that. Where's the fight? Okay, we're gonna go back to the castle to retrain. <laughs> you got lucky your stupid artillery Dublin upgraded now they're a huge city okay we know the English stand executing the prisoners they capture Baron's Alliance just got wiped out Cannot go there, sire. Yes, sire. I guess it was the rebels that did that. Aye, my king. Aye, my king. Tis good to see you, my friend. How can we help? Uh, can I have some money? I'm just kidding. I have plenty of money. Okay, well, these guys are going to regret doing that, Mr. I'm so cool, Captain John. 31 years old? I guess. Okay, we'll hopefully get these guys here before they get attacked by the English. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pull back this army to the castle. Get them all retrained. We're going to attack down here. Oh, the English have fallen off of that. Look at those English sending a Townsend or a... An assassin tried to get rid of my guys. No. It's not how it works. You don't mess with us. Noah. It's amazing. Yeah, they're afraid of my leader, that's for sure. He's assassinating people he doesn't like, so. I'd love for these guys to... I mean, I want Montgomery. Montgomery's a, a large city. Oh, I won. Awesome. 24 to the snob? Well, okay. Don Chad. She had really no help. Okay, so... I cannot believe how many men I lost. I'm gonna merge my men here. I know I just lost them, and it'll be easy for me to uh, replenish them. 
So I'll ship those guys over there. My king. I lord. Splitting up the troops, sire. I sire. That is so dumb how I lost all those guys. Oh, let's retrain them. And so, what does this guy's army need? Look at that upkeep. Ridiculous. So your army needs one more archer. And a lot more of these swords guys. Swordsmen. So I'll give you three more of those guys. Let's get our own catapults to show those English who they're messing with. These guys have just landed. They're going to head to Chester. We capture this. I'm going to push in towards down here. I'm just going to push right towards Montgomery. That army seems to have been defeated. I have assassins everywhere. Captain Richard. Goodbye, Captain Richard. Captain Toby. So these guys have been upgraded. I'm not going to do anything. I'm just going to try to keep people happy. Down Patrick is suffering issues. We'll put you back to a normal tax rate. Give you a city hall and coaching house. Where's the fight? And I would like to build basic crop rotation here and an archery range. That should help out. Okay, ending a turn. Command me. No. Come and get Whoa. Coward. Armored sergeant spam. When did the English get all these men? Moving out. Well, I want to besiege this. Hopefully they'll pick uh, Montgomery to save as I take over this city. Yeah, so we'll do that. I'll also... Welsh Long Bowman wouldn't be bad. Can we finish them yet, sire? Wait, a thousand each? No. Well, then again, I do want a thousand coin. Something to investigate. They won't ken them there, sire. I don't want them in the fort. I'm gonna forget about them. Okay, so these guys are here. Where's the fight? This guy's army is retraining, so we have to wait one more turn. I can't believe I got so... Oh, boy. The English beat back the Welsh, and here I am attacking. Can I withdraw from this? Yes, I can. So I defeat this big army, I can take this. Oh, come on, I used to have more than 20 units, because that's fair. Let's go. You know, we have brave Irish soldiers, a great king. I think we can uh, take these guys down. I love a little quotes from William Wallace here. Braveheart's a good movie to watch. Now, okay, here's the thing. We're going to charge these men. Right, soldiers? We're going to charge. Do I just have this many swordsmen in this army? Oh, boy, this isn't good. Yeah, we're going to use our skirmishing advantage. I'm just going to shoot at these guys for a little while. Particularly. Look how they just like rose up. So we're going to move our troops here. I do have a decent amount of cavalry that's highly veteran. Um, these guys are gold chevrons and silver. The lowest ones are general, 58 men who's our king. These Welsh guys can already... Oh my goodness, they're opening fire on us. And they're using flaming missiles. You see that doesn't do a lot of damage. Like all that and they haven't taken any casualties. They're like one, one guy got hit. Okay. You know I hate pause in the game, but in a battle this close and this outnumbered.
I need all we got. And this cavalry better be a force. Okay, we're meeting the main English advance there. These armored sergeants will eat. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. These guys only fire flaming shot. See, so, yeah, I'm gonna try to get my men on this side. They are routing, which is good. So we just broke these armored scum. <laughs> More of them are coming in. Do these armored sergeants really want to charge my general? You have some guts, man. Wow, look, these guys are just turning and running. The enemy general has no honor. He flees the field of battle and abandons his men. Push in my soldaten. Yeah, this is the best England has to offer to face these brave Irish soldiers. Oh no, there's no way in hell you're just going to get a away with all these men. Look at that, total route. We're just going to have everyone target this unit here. And we're just riding through, racking up the kills there, racking up the prisoners. And we're, we remember what the English did to our prisoners in the last battle, where they were lucky on the bridge. You remember what they did? They executed them. And I always execute the prisoners, I know, but like... It's a little scummy. How big is that unit 38? Not too worried about them. So I'm going to switch the... Actually, I guess I will kind of worry about them. I'll switch those guys over. You know, this is why you have like five or six cavalry units, especially in Evil 2. You can just hunt down enemy units like that. Oh, there's 40 unit over there. We will literally slaughter these guys. So the general is going to try to kill some of those guys. These guys are rather large. You know, I'm going to shift all of those guys onto that unit. Yeah, look at that. These guys, tons of kills, I'm sure. The general usually has a little bit of trouble because uh, they are heavier horses. So you just have to pull your men through. Like, push them right through the enemy and then uh, click an attack order. Like that. By the way, we have like a thousand prisoners. How amazing is that? There's like a couple men on those, like one unit there, one unit there. Oh, look at this one guy, he's like, doesn't know where to go. So these guys are moving in, taking out these guys. So you just have to do this, I mean, just... Die like men. You don't have the cavalry involved on this one. I guess it was good to have some archers, but look at these guys. Two men left. Oh, that's a heavy bowman unit. 64 men. These guys are here. We've pretty much wiped out the English, so... Take yourself off flaming shot. 
This armored sergeant. I like these Welsh longbowmen. They're pretty decent units. These guys only fire flaming arrows, apparently. So I took them off. You imagine being that you're like you see hundreds of archers and they're just shooting at you. And that guy was wiped out. What about over here? So it has taken a little while to take down all these men, but it's very important. We do have a unit all the way back there. Do we have any cavalry not moving? Where'd he go? Ah, here he is. I think, right? Okay, we're gonna task all our cavalry on those guys, and we will six speed this. So we took 1,300 prisoners. Not the most prisoners I've ever taken, but I mean, yeah, this army was so intimidating until their armored sergeant spam broke. The guy will catch this guy, no problem. He still has like half the map to get off anyway. Has to get off the map by like, I mean, he's in the middle of it pretty much. And these are armored sergeants. The enemy are utterly vanquished. <laughs> well, 158 men. 15 men got away. That is how you do it. Gosh, this, that was fun. <laughs> like, yeah, I'll be taking this. Oh, execute. Yeah. Look, they're attacking the Welsh now. I'll hire some mercenaries. Do I want Shrewsbury? No, you know what I want? I want Montgomery. Okay, we really need your soldiers down here, so... You know, good enough. That guy's a lot of a dread. Let's see if we'll kick open the door on our guy. <laughs> Sullivan. Sullivan is just not up there yet. He's getting better though with experience. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this part. We fought a battle, we lost a battle, and we won a battle, so. King Domnal. Great warrior. Aye. Who needs a second smile? Awaiting your command. We shall listen to your proposal, but do not expect much. Your question is direct and fair. We understand your resolution. Oh, there's men actually. Oh, I like that. I guess I bribe him some English. I should do that. Yeah, let's do. Let's start bribing some armies away. Oh, we need more spies or anything. King Walter the Killer. <laughs> yeah, we'll mop up this. I mean, I, I don't really. I, I wish uh, the way the Welsh faction would be doing better on this game anyway. But looks like we're gonna be taking over Wales. Well, I mean, parts of it at least. These areas. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Go enjoy this. Cover on T21 signing off.